For Asmik as an excellent spirit, and knowledge, and understanding, interpreting of dreams, and chewing of hard sentences, and dissolving of doubts, were found in the same Daniel, whom the king named Belteshazzar. Now let Daniel be called, and he will shew the interpretation. Then was Daniel brought in before the king. And the king spake and said unto Daniel, Art thou that Daniel, which art of the children of the captivity of Judah, whom the king my father brought out of Jury? I have even heard of thee, that the spirit of the gods is in thee, and that light and understanding and excellent wisdom is found in thee. The elite and wealthy after sending their children to school, and graduated, will insist they go to what is called a finishing school, where etiquette, human and behavioral relations, wisdom, etc., are thought and impacted on them. Inasmuch as this is not condemnable, it is still a far cry from what you have read in the above scriptures. And ye shall not judge after the sight of his eyes, neither reprove after the hearing of his ears. The man whose imprint and legacy on earth can never be erased, operated with the above spirits, and today it speaks in the lives of billions across the globe. His name is Jesus, and his disciples displayed same. Acts 4 13 KJV Now when they saw the boldness of Peter and John, and perceived that they were unlearned and ignorant men, they marveled. And they took knowledge of them, that they had been with Jesus. You cannot keep company with the one who is the same yesterday, today, and forever, and not be a transformer, and if you are not, then you probably don't know him. Examine yourself. Do have a pleasant weekend. Eid.